guys and we're back with another skincare review today. Today we are doing the Art Naturals Vitamin C Advanced Moisture and Brightening Formula Serum. So there's a couple sizes of this bottle that they sell. There's also a little miniature like trial size. I've got that too that I'm trying to use up. But this is the full size one and this is one fluid ounce which Fair warning, pretty much everywhere on the internet they sell it, the pictures they use make it look like it's a lot bigger, but th this is <laughs> this is the full size, so don't be fooled. Now, depending on where you buy it from, the pricing varies wildly, and I would say if you're going to get the full size of it, get the three pack that also comes with the retinol and the hyaluronic acid serums as well because you're going to get the most bang for your buck. Especially if you buy it off of Amazon. I believe on there I paid like, I want to say it was $18. So that would break down to about $6 per serum. And honestly, that is not bad. That is not bad at all. That's like about on par with the ordinary. Now, if you buy it from the actual Art Naturals website, I think they charge about $27 for that same set, which breaks down to about 9 bucks per bottle, if I did the math right. I probably didn't. I think I did, though. 9 times 3 is 27, right? Yeah, so it's about 9 bucks per bottle. If you try and buy the bottles individually, oh, it jumps vastly to where it's like 13 bucks or something. It's like... I have a better idea, I'll just buy the value pack. <laughs> you can also buy these at Target and probably other places too, but those are the three places I know of for sure that they sell these. So I got mine off of Amazon because it was the most cost-effective way and because it is, in fact, their brand selling on there. It's not like weird third-party sellers that are selling like counterfeits. No, no, it's like actually them. It's legit. So you do get the most bang for your buck there. And if you have Prime, you don't have to pay shipping either, so you save even more money. No, this is not a sponsorship for Amazon. This is literally just me trying to help you guys save some money. So, anyways. Vitamin C serums are, like, one of the most basic ones, but they also are, like, the most widely touted because they seem to help the most skin types. They're good for all skin types. They help with, like, anti-aging. They help with moisture retention. They help with discolorations, redness, breakouts. They help with so many things. Like, even on the side of here, it says, Say goodbye to dull, dry skin with our rejuvenating vitamin C serum. Use daily to target signs of aging, hydrate, and bring your skin back to its natural, beautiful glow. Directions after washing and toning, which I already did, apply a small amount of serum to face, neck, and decolletage. Allow for complete absorption before applying moisturizer and makeup. So, honestly, not bad at all. It says toss 12 months after opening. Now, a word, anything with vitamin C in it, this goes for any product, not just this brand, not just serums. Anything with vitamin C in it, keep it out of direct sunlight. Keep it in a cool, dry place. Otherwise, it will oxidize way faster, and while it's still safe to use if that happens, you won't get the same benefits out of it, so it kind of defeats the purpose. So, anyways, I'm going to take my glasses off just to make it easier to apply, but it's been a while since you guys saw my actual eyeballs. But, um, anyway, it comes with this eyedropper in it. It's pretty standard for a serum, so just fill that bad boy up. What the hell? Hold on. There is definitely something in here. I may use my little mini size because I don't know what got in here, but I am not trusting that. Hold up. Plan B will use the mini baby bottle. That looked like a bug. I'm throwing that out. I'm, I'm going to be replacing that bottle. That was not in there when I bought it. I have used it. That was not a thing that was in there. I don't know what the hell happened, but I am, yeah, ew. So, double checking because now I'm paranoid, but yeah, okay. All is well. Okay, so, you don't need very much, clearly. See this? A little bit on your face, a little bit goes a long way. That was not even the whole dropper. It just came out real quick. Don't need a whole ton for your nose, but I like to put it there anyway. Then the forehead is always like the... <laughs> First time I've done this on camera, and yeah, I screwed that up. 
you, you're welcome for the fail compilation that will no doubt stem from that one. Anyway. Let me go rinse it off my mouth, because honestly, I'm not safe if you get it on your lips. I, I imagine it probably is, but let's not chance it, okay? Hold on. Sorry about that. This video is one of a million fails all around, isn't it? So, <laughs> but, um, anyway. So, yeah, you just kind of, like, tap it in. Like, not rub, just tap to help absorb it. Vitamin C is, like, one of the fastest absorbing serums, it seems like. Especially after using toner right before it. So it won't take you real long. Yeah, it already mostly feels absorbed in. And you'll have this natural glow to your skin from it. Which is always nice. No need for a highlighter this day. So, <laughs> but, um... One thing that I have noticed big time uh, since starting to use vitamin C serums, more so than anything else, is just the overall softness I feel in my skin when I've been using them. Like, it is unreal how soft and smooth it makes my skin. So I don't know if that's just a me thing, I don't know if that's an everybody thing, since I know some people's mileage varies when it comes to vitamin C serums, but I've had very good luck with them, so hopefully you guys will too, but yeah. Doesn't matter if you use the little size or the full size. Like I said, don't know what happened there. That was not a thing when I bought it. But, <laughs> boy, I'm paranoid now. I'm like, how much do I have left in here? How long do I need to, like, buy a replacement of that full size bottle? I'm trying to see in the light. I think it's about half full. Yeah, it's not even quite. All right. Should probably replace that soon then. But, yeah, don't, don't judge it off of the fail. I don't know what happened there. But, regardless... For the price, honestly, this stuff is pretty solid, and I've been very pleasantly surprised by it. <laughs> so, I, uh, honestly, I cannot recommend it enough. I think it's a wonderful product, especially for being as cheap as it is. You know, expensive doesn't necessarily equal better. Sometimes the cheap stuff just it works just as well, if not better, than the expensive stuff. So, you don't need to make yourself go broke to have good skincare. Just saying. And I've been using this stuff for probably at least a year now. Um, so, again, can't complain. I think it's really, really nice. I've definitely seen huge improvements in my skin overall since I've started using it. Between this and the hyaluronic acid one, like, those two in conjunction with one another, you can use them separately or you can layer them on top of each other. Those two, they are, like, best frenzies. So, <laughs> you can use them together at the same time. Doesn't matter. But, yeah, I have noticed such an improvement in my skin tone, in my complexion, just the appearance of my skin, everything, since using those two products. So, again cannot recommend them highly enough to you. No, this is not sponsored. This is just a thing I tried that I think is wonderful and it's really affordable. And given how much some people spend on their skincare, I feel like when I find little, like, hidden gems like this, you guys need to know about them so you can do your skin a favor and save some money while you do it. So, anyways, that's it for this one, guys. So, as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time. Bye-bye.